Hey guys, today I have a project that is near and dear to my heart. This is my newest Metroid arm cannon. So, let's check it out. Alright, pause right there. If you like cool sci-fi projects like this, go ahead and like and subscribe down below because I have plenty of cool stuff coming your way. But let's get back to it. So today I have my, my much more updated arm cannon. So if you check this one out, you'll see that uh, it's, it's still made out of PVC, but it has these raised covers for the details on, on the back. And it's got uh, an area for a battery here that actually runs an Arduino on the side that has a, a sound system and uh, also runs these servo motors. And uh, on the side here, it's got the main power switch and it has this voltmeter and uh, that kind of tells me how much battery life I have and it shows me how much power they, uh, the lasers are actually pulling. So you'll notice that it actually opens and turns and of course shoots a powerful 8 watt laser. Did I mention that uh, this is a modular system? I can put different attachments on the sides here. So what kind of attachments would I have? Maybe the most requested attachment you can think of. <laughs> I remember when Metroid Prime came out and they had a display station at Walmart and you could sit there and you could play the opening scenes of the game at the at the Space Pirate Frigate and it was it was so awesome I had never played a game like that and uh, you know you, you start out you have this arm cannon you have this cool power suit and you're, you're running through the frigate and you're you're fighting increasingly harder bad guys and man I, I remember uh, when I, when I got to this giant bug crawling up through a thing and you had to figure out how to get through the force fields and shoot it and stuff and then suddenly the frigate's gonna blow up and you're trying to run out of there and you end up encountering this giant dragon and at the time I had no idea that it was Ridley and that he was the leader of the space pirates and all of this whole backstory all I knew is that I was trying to escape a place and I had to fight a giant dragon and 
man, and then he flies out of there and I run back to my ship and I hop on and boom, now I'm on this crazy planet. You know, all that crazy stuff. Well, I played that demo at Walmart so many times to where I could beat that entire thing. And when I finally got a GameCube and I finally got that game, I was able to blast through it and suddenly I'm on these other planets and I'm, I'm scanning things and I'm learning about the Chozo and I'm learning about this deep, rich story. Man, it was so epic and it inspired me to make a series of these crazy arm cannons and even start working on my own power suit. So that was my Metroid arm cannon video, the newest model that I've got going on right now. Um, I really hope that you liked it. If you've watched it this far, you're probably already subscribed and you've already liked this video. But if you haven't, right now is the time to do it. Uh, so you can be informed when I post cool projects like this one or any of my other stuff. I've got plenty of cool content coming your way. And uh, you know, thanks again. I really appreciate you watching my videos. And, uh, you know, thanks a lot, guys. So I'll see you next time.